Okay, check it out, guys. <laughs> Frame up on me, Mike. Is that too fast? Uh, I mean, it hurt. The dark arts, baby. So check it out. <laughs> this is one of my favorite wrist socks from, from side mount. I probably blasted it too fast. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mike. That's all so right. check it out. Your partner's framed up as a good Jesus person would. I noticed the frame is a little shallow. So what I do is I collect it with my chin, right? I have a nice big chin that kind of helps me for this one. Boom, right there. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna point this elbow. So here, point the elbow. I already started collapsing that wrist, if you guys can see that. Now this other arm that was cross-facing comes over and stacks here. Now I'm gonna start driving into that right there. It's a very quick submission when you, once you collapse that wrist. So one more time. I pass guard, I settle, I got the cross, I got the underhook, the person's framing up. Not so hard because I can't fucking oh, talk, Mike. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay. I'm nervous about the wrist lock, man. So check it out. One, two, point that elbow. Three, and now look, I'm on my toes, I'm driving into it. I'm, and I'm also turning my body this way into it. Right? I'm trying to get my pressure coming down this way as I have my hands stacked, okay? One last time on this one, Mike. <clears throat> One, two, and honestly, these, th these two movements probably happen simultaneously for me, right? The chin collapse and the elbow point, just like this. And then this one comes in right after. I stack my hands, get my toes, start driving into it, and then I get the tap, right? So, very effective for me. My, my partners have gotten wise to my, my, uh, my dark arts ways, right? They avoid the wrist lock, so the way they do that is actually go deeper with the cross face. So as you guys can see now, it's not in position, right? It's too, it's too deep. I can't, I can't collapse that wrist. So this is what I do, guys. I come in here, come in here, push it, push it, push it, push it, till it gets to where I want it. Once it's right there, there it is. I collapse my chin again, and now I go right into it, right? Because they're gonna want to try to hold that position, right? They don't want it to to, to slide down. But it's two on one, right? I'm, both of my hands are against his. And it's gonna end up right there. And I've done this so long, so often that, that I know right where it's in danger. It's already in danger right there. Boom. It's already there. See how quickly he's tapping? Is yeah. that really painful? You fucking are you overacting for the video, Mike? No, no, no. I'm well, I am a great YouTube actor. He's overacting, but guys. No, that shit hurts, right. man. Okay, so one last time. I'm here, it's too deep. One, the underhook arm goes through. I come here. I push, 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 there it is right there. I collapse, I point, there it is right there, all right? Another very common thing, and I'm just gonna show you what I do when they try to do this. When I go to this, they try to shoot their underhook. Boom, go to, yeah, boom, they try to do this, right? Because they see, okay, there's a window of opportunity for me get, to get to my underhook, all right? So, I come in here, sorry. Readjust, get that mic back in position. I am in position. <laughs> One, two, he starts sliding, feels the underhook is available, I elbow down, right? So I, I'm kind of expecting they might shoot that underhook, I elbow down. Now it's kind of in not a, not a very good position for him, so they're probably gonna try to come back to the cross face or, or to the frame, yes. But then I capture it. And now I have other options off of this, right? So this will lead to a bunch of other submissions that I'm gonna show you guys here soon. But for now, let's focus on these wrist locks, right? 